If you think construction is bad on Minnesota Avenue, wait until next year when the city begins reconstructing East 26th Street near Southeastern. Even the city says it's going to be a nightmare. The city says that it's going to be taking two years to close and close to $40 million to build a six lane overpass over the railroad tracks near Rotary Park. And while it's going to be a big headache for drivers in that area while it's under construction, the city says they'll love it when it's finished. For years, trains have derailed morning and evening commutes along East 26th Street. This is one of the busiest sections in town and probably one of the most congested during rush hour. Every time a train crosses, traffic gets backed up for blocks. That's why the city and the South Dakota Department of Transportation have teamed up for a huge undertaking. It'll be one of the biggest we've done. Starting next spring, they'll begin building a huge overpass so drivers won't have to sit and wait for the trains. But it's going to be a two-year project. Uh, it's going to be, uh, it's going to, it's going to test our uh, street network. <laughs> and probably most people's patience. Because of the anticipated construction, the city is in the process now of relocating Rotary Park to the west side of the river. So it's going to be a brand new restroom, brand new shelter, uh, brand new playground over there. And the big part of it is a pedestrian bridge you, can, you might be able to see behind me. And that's so people who are using the bike trail can get over to the west side of the river to use the park. That bridge will span 200 feet over the river when it's complete. They've had to build what's called a coffer dam to keep the river bottom dry enough to get the bridge footings in place. But the weather has delayed the project. It's already wet the way it is, and we've had a pretty wet summer. So it's, it's been tough, but they've been doing well. The park is scheduled to be done before the end of the year, just in time for crews to begin work on the 26th Street overpass. It's going to improve access in this whole area. Uh, and it's going to make uh, traffic move more efficiently and safer. The city will have makeshift tunnels in place to keep that portion of the bike path open while crews work on that overpass.